Hey everyone, Tara Jane here. Welcome to my channel and I hope you all had a lovely week. This video is going to be the first of a series of tutorials that I'll be uploading every week called Saturday Sketches. Today's tutorial will be a classic country pathway overlooking a field with a ring or arch of leaves. So grab your sketchbooks, open a new page, and let's get into it. So I often like to start my paintings with whatever is furthest away. I'm picking very bright blues and greens for the fields in the back because I want there to be a strong and bold contrast with the arch of leaves. I don't want the fields to be too detailed, but I do take a small brush here to make the tree line more blended. Then I'll move straight onto the tree archway, taking a very dark green to black and layering it down as my base color. And taking the same color, I'm then adding definition to the layer by creating branches and leaves with my smallest brush. Then for my pathway, I'd like the dirt path to be at the bottom where the grass can be laid over it. So I'm going ahead and putting down shadows with a darker brown closer to the screen. And then again, using the darkest color for the grass, I lay down with a dark green and place my lighter layers on top. So layering from darkest to lightest. And that just helps to create a little bit of depth. Once I'm done with my top layers of leaves and plants, I go through and add some blue highlights to show where the light may be hitting the leaves. And then I go through to add different layers for the tree arch. I like to use a range of different greens with more blue shades and then more yellow shades so that the leaves look more wild, plentiful and messy. And for the final touches, I just go through the sketch looking for places to brighten up with some lighter green. So maybe add some speckles of yellow or outlines of pink, just to make things a little bit brighter and more interesting. And there you have it, a quick country road sketch ready to start on an adventure. I hope you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up if you'd like to see more and leave a comment on what tutorial you'd like to see next week. Bye!